Okay, I'm set back up again, this time with a racket going through the first main. So there is a one grommet that I'm going through, but it's a straight pull through that grommet. I'm still on the 50 pounds that I was on at the end of the last video. So we'll just thread it through and tension and see I'm pulling flat. The machine is flat on my workbench here. Looks like there's a little space under it, but it's just the way the workbench is. So my machine is nice and flat. It's pulling against the frame, nice and flush. And my tension is 46 pounds. So that was 50 and 46. So that was actually quite a bit different from the last one I had. Um, but still inaccurate. Let's go down to 45. There you go, you can see a little better there that I'm at 45. All right, I'll keep it up nice and close here so you can see the tension head and everything moving. So there we go, made itself nice and flush. Pulled tension, green lights on. 45 pounds is equal to Ta-da! Who knew? 45 pounds is equal to 36 pounds. Uh, so that's not good. Let's go the other way. Let's go up to 55 pounds. 55 pounds. It's about as dead on 55 pounds as I can get. Press the, it's the button, there's my tensioning. Come on up, 55 pounds is equal to, let's see, the black one's the readout, or the max. So the red one, it's equal to 57 and a half, about 57 pounds. I think that was about what I had on the other one without the racket in the way. So 55 was equal to 57. Now let's go up to 60. I think 60 was either 64 or 65 last time was my actual readout. Tension pulled. Sixty. 68 and a half, 68 you can call it. So this time 60 was equal to 68. Again, inconsistencies, inconsistencies. Let's go up to 62. I think I did 62 was the max I went to last time, but it was only about 68. So I'm on 62. 62, almost maxed out my machine. 74 pounds. Inconsistencies abound. Now let's go to, let's wind it back down to 55. And let's see if we still have 57 as our readout. 55. Press to tension. See, last time 55 was equal to 57. This time 55 is equal to 59 and a half, 59. I think part of that is, like I said, dialing to 55. Dialing to a number either from above or below due to the inconsistencies in this twisting. The knob turn does not equally turn that tension indicator every time. I wish I could show it better, but it's just so small, that indicator, it's almost impossible. So, I'm at 50 pounds. Tension. 48. 47 and a half, 48. So, 
There we go, guys. Have at it. What do you want next?